Hello, my name is Dr. Mark Clanton. I'm an MPH graduate in the class of 1990. I reside in Dallas, Texas, and I'm currently chair of the Alumni Awards Committee. The Awards Committee convenes annually to review nominations and select the award recipients. It is a great privilege to complete this work, and the recipients are all so deserving of this recognition. The Award of Merit is the highest honor the Alumni Association can bestow upon an individual. On behalf of the Awards Committee, we are honored to present Lois B. Travis with the 2021 Alumni Award of Merit. Curing cancer is a modern miracle, one that can take its toll on patients and that has created a new patient population, cancer survivors. One investigator has dedicated her career to understanding and preventing health risks for this population, producing research and clinical applications, creating international research teams that address these issues, and mentoring the next generation of professionals in the field of cancer survivorship. With a broad academic background and a varied career as a physician, researcher, and teacher, few people have had as much of an impact on cancer survivorship as Dr. Lois B. Travis. Today, Dr. Travis is the Lawrence H. Einhorn Professor of Cancer Research and Principal Investigator of the Platinum Study, an international study of cancer survivors, which she developed and leads. She credits her grandfather for instilling a work ethic that served her well through residencies and fellowships at the Mayo Clinic and the National Cancer Institute, and master's and doctoral degrees at the Harvard T.H. Chan School of Public Health under the mentorship of Dr. Brian McMahon. She served in a number of roles at federal agencies, including the National Cancer Institute, before taking academic appointments at the University of Rochester and her present position at Indiana University. While at the National Cancer Institute, Dr. Travis's research on cancer survivors advanced the medical community's understanding of dose-response relationships between radiotherapy and chemotherapy and second malignant neoplasms. For her work, Dr. Travis was awarded the National Cancer Institute's Public Health Service Outstanding Service Medal, a committee she chaired for the National Council on Radiation Protection and Measurements, NCRP, released a highly cited report of over 400 pages entitled, Second Primary Cancers in Cardiovascular Disease After Radiation Therapy. She also received an Outstanding Service Award from the NCRP for this accomplishment. She also served on the inaugural steering committee for the National Cancer Institute's Office of Cancer Survivorship and the first Cancer Survivorship Task Force convened by the American Society of Clinical Oncology. In 2009, Dr. Travis organized an international multidisciplinary workshop to target research priorities in cancer survivorship, forming partnerships with an international team of experts from leading institutions. This team joined Dr. Travis's Platinum Study, focusing their research on understudied adolescent and young adult cancer survivors. The Platinum Study was awarded two multi-institutional grants from the National Cancer Institute to study the long-term adverse effects of platinum-based chemotherapy on testicular cancer survivors. Celebrated as a teacher and advisor, Dr. Travis was honored with the Reuben Mitchell Award for Excellence in mentoring young physicians and scientists while at the University of Rochester Medical Center. More recently, she completed the prestigious University of Michigan Rudy Ansbacher Leadership Scholars Program, which seeks to accelerate the development of women for senior positions in academic medicine and healthcare. For her research that has led to significant changes in cancer treatment, her contributions to the field of cancer survivorship, her insights that have improved the quality of life for cancer survivors, and her dedication to her students and mentees, the Harvard T.H. Chan School of Public Health Alumni Association recognizes Dr. Lois B. Travis with the 2021 Alumni Award of Merit. Thank you so much for this wonderful recognition. It brings cancer survivors to the forefront where they belong. It was my training at Harvard that taught me how to conduct large international studies 
that examine the late effects of cancer treatment. No one becomes successful on their own. I have many to thank starting at the beginning. My creator for the ability to excel, my husband for his love and support, the many teachers, mentors, and colleagues at great institutions such as Harvard, the NCI, and Indiana University that have enabled me to conduct cancer survivorship research. In particular, I'm indebted to Brian McMahon, Joe Framini, and John Boyce. Thank you again to the Harvard Alumni Association, and I look forward to being with you in person next year.